We're going to show you how to connect headsets to the C4. So we've got a 20S Evo here, and it's on. You can see the blue light blinking. And we have another 20S Evo here. We're going to go ahead and turn it on. Hello. And then here's your C4 control panel, the plus and the minus. So we're going to go in and start this thing up. Media connected. So now we're going to go into the intercom menu. And then we're going to tap the plus button. Intercom pairing. And that puts it into intercom pairing mode. We're going to take the first 20S, hold the jog button down. Intercom pairing. Now you can tap the jog button, or we can go over to the C4, and we'll tap the plus button on it, and then that'll tell the two headsets to connect. And now they're connected, and you can see the LED is blinking rapidly. That means that the microphone is open. So we're going to go ahead and tap out of that. And then we're going to connect the other Evo. So we're going to go back over here, tap the menu button, and then tap the plus button. Intercom pairing. So now the C4 is looking for another headset. So we're going to hold the jog button down on this one. Rather than go back to the C4 and tap that plus button over there, we're going to tap the jog button here. Now it's going to tell the two headsets to look for each other. Now we're connected. So now if you want to connect up to headset friend number one, we're going to go into the menu and then tap. And that connected us up with headset number two. Now if we want to cook up the headset number one, we're going to press the menu button again and tap it twice. And now we're connected to the other headset. So now all three headsets are connected. But there's an easier way to do that and we're going to show you how to do that next. We're going to start a group intercom now is one of the features that this uh, headset has. So we're going to go into the menu again by pressing the minus button and then we're going to tap it again. Group intercom. And now you'll notice that the LEDs are blinking green. So with just that one motion we were able to set up a group intercom with the headsets that we're already connected to. We're going to disconnect the group intercom by pressing the minus button for three seconds. Group intercom terminated. So now everybody's back to blink and blue slow and they're all disconnected from the C4. So in video number two here, we're going to hook the uh, C4 directly up to our iPhone here. So we're going to go into settings, Bluetooth, and then we're going to go back into the menu. We're going to hold the plus button down for about 10 seconds until we get into the configuration menu. Configuration menu. And then we're going to tap it until we find mobile phone pairing, which is going to be right away. Phone pairing. So here we see the SC1. We'll tap on it. Your headset is paired. And now we're connected. 
So we can go into our music, choose artists, let's do a little Alan Jackson. Okay, so let's say we want to pause the music. We just hold the plus button down. And you'll hear a double beep, and that'll pause it. Start it back up, you hear a double beep. Let's say we want to go to the next track. We're going to hold it down a little bit longer. Go to the next track. And that's how you can control your music on your phone through the Bluetooth headset. So in this demonstration, we're going to go ahead and hook the uh, phone up to the NAV6. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is go into settings, Bluetooth, scan for devices, Set your Bluetooth device to find me or discover mode. Well, it is. And by golly, it's found my phone. I'll say OK. Now the Bluetooth pairing request, we want to pair. We want to say OK here. Say yes there. And we want to allow. And now we're connected. So we're going to go ahead and connect the NAV6 to the C4. So as what we're going to do, go into the configuration menu. Configuration menu. Phone pairing. So phone pairing. So we're going to go into scan for devices. Say OK. See, but we're going to we're going to go here, say OK, requesting connection. Your headset is paired. So now, if we want to play music through the phone, we can go into the phone's music, play a little iHeartRadio, a little flip. <laughs> So now we're streaming music from the phone through the NAV6. So now, with the cradle out of the GTL or GT or RT, we can actually go into the apps and we can use the media player. We're going to change that to MP3 player. Save, and we have 20th Century Fox The Doors, 